Hello and welcome back to Friday Minis. Now, have you seen those types of graph paper that, you know, have things laid out at an interesting angle? In fact, I believe the term is isometric. It actually allows you to draw out a 3D shape using that grid of boxes. And well, you do actually get the illusion of 3D, but it looks kind of weird. Even though you do see a 3D object, it appears quite unnatural. Its shape just doesn't feel right. Well, this is the difference between orthographic and perspective projection. Imagine this. Imagine you're standing at a long corridor and, well, you know that all the lines of the corridor are parallel to each other. I mean, the wall to your left and the wall to your right are parallel. But when you actually look down the corridor, they don't look parallel at all. All these lines that you know are pointed in the same direction are not pointing in the same direction when you look. That is actually the effect of perspective. In the real world, parallel lines do not appear parallel. Basically, that is how we sort of get some information about the depth because things converge to a point. Going back to the diagram on a graph paper, that is actually not the case. All the lines are parallel, no matter you know whether they're close to you or they're far back. In fact, you can see a similar effect you know, in your 3D program. Just switch over to orthographic projection, and it will basically keep all the parallel lines parallel. Orthographic projection isn't generally used if you're trying to make art, you know, if you're trying to create something that is meant to look nice. However, it does have its uses particularly in the context of, say, engineering or design. You want to see where lines are parallel because you want to have an accurate representation of whatever it is you're designing. So there you go. That's the difference between orthographic and perspective projections. That's all there is for this episode of Friday Minis. I hope you learned something today, but until next time, you're watching 0612 TV. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, consider checking out the rest of my work on my channel. Alternatively, you may be interested in a playlist of all the other episodes of Friday Minis. If you'd like to show me some monetary support, I am on Patreon. You can find a link to my campaign in the video description. Of course, you can simply like this video or leave a comment. I'll be sure to respond as soon as I can. To keep in touch with my future uploads, do subscribe to this channel. And for even more updates, check out the official Twitter account for this channel at 0612TV. Thank you for your support.